Oh yeah, how are you going guys? Marche here, doing a walk and talk vlog because I don't have time to just sort of like find a spot and stand. I just got to keep on moving. So, got something to say, really important. So, check it out. Yeah, that's the Peel River at the moment. So, she is very dry. That's the driest I've ever seen her in my 10 years, or 11 years now, coming here. Never seen the Peel River that dry. Day two. You're looking at Peel River. The weather report said there was an 80% chance of rain by 12 o'clock. That's what the weather was saying. I don't know if you can see the clouds probably. But there's no hint of rain. This is what town was facing. It's like even though there's supposed to be rain, there's not rain. So you know they really need rain, so hopefully we do get rain, just not enough to flood us out. <laughs> Two hours later. Clouds are rolling in. Well, it's starting to rain here, which is good news for Tamworth, it is. And the lightning and thunder starting to happen. Well, we've had a bit of rain, and as you can see behind me, there's still clouds going off. The next step. we got Andy working on a couple songs. And not only is he running the canteen with the lovely Rihanna, but he's also warming up to perform. Later. behind me it's raining but the thing is is no one's complaining because everybody knows Tamwin needs the rain and we got the stage down here ready to roll got some great acts tonight it's gonna be really fun I'm gonna do a rocking set so yeah check it out Several bad puns later. It's amazing what a little bit of rain can do. There's a bit of water. A little bit more water in the Peel River. But it's still not flowing. So hopefully they'll get a bit more rain. The wind shifted. So I, I don't know when this video is going to go up. Uh, I got things. I got videos edited for Country Loud and everything else. Had the Reg Lindsay concert, which you'll see. 
Got back from Reg Lindsay and um, the wind shifted and came from that direction, coming this way and smashed up my campsite. I gotta say a huge thank you to everybody here at the campsite because I wasn't around and they you know they raced around picking up my stuff and put in a nice little pile so that everything was safe and taken care of so now I gotta suss out what I'm gonna do I gotta see if I can fix the gazebo this yeah apparently it's pretty trashed they folded it up but yeah, if I can't, it's going to be a very interesting festival. <laughs> Still got a week to go. Anyway, this is Tamworth. <laughs> Another just part of the Tamworth adventures. So yeah, I'm just making this a real civil vlog. I thought you guys would get a kick out of it. And you know what? Hey, I'm playing music, doing my thing, seeing some great artists and hearing some great music and that's what it's about anyway uh yeah <laughs> oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. see if i can fix it even if i can fix it if the wind keeps going this way i can't set it up the way i did have it so huh. gonna have to try and get creative i think So many things to do. I've just been flat out again. I've got to say thank you uh, to everybody. I was at a gig. I got back and my campsite was trashed from the, the wind. And since I wasn't around, everybody around just jumped into action and salvaged my stuff. Had to do some repairs, but I got my campsite up and going. Still got a week to go yet. And yeah, it's like that. <laughs> so I've had to run up the road, do a bit of things. It's good to see things bustling around. It's a little bit of, a little bit quieter than normal, but people are getting into the action. And look behind me. We got the superstar of Riverside Campgrounds, Greg. And, yeah. But I just gotta thank everybody. I know it's windy. But it's like, thanks to the, thanks to the whole um, campsite disaster. I'm a bit behind, that's why I didn't post anything yesterday. Plus I had stuff Country Loud Digital, if you want to see the Star Maker stuff, jump over to the Country Loud Facebook page. And yeah, <laughs> it's just Tamworth. It's hectic, but it's great. And it's so good. And it's such a community feeling. Even from people, you know, that total strangers will jump in, help you, offer you stuff to help, you know, fix things. I had everybody coming up seeing if I was all right. Um, everybody was like, oh, where are you gonna sleep? Like, it is quite warm here in Tamworth. And um, so my little van that I sleep in, I got a little bed in the back of my van and it gets really hot. So that's why I have a gazebo coming off it. So that way I can sleep with the door open and still have some privacy. <laughs> And without it, it would be baking. I just gotta switch hands because things are getting heavy. Oh, yeah. So I'm racing back because it's one o'clock and we got the, um, we got the stage happening at two. So 
I've got to get that all organized. And I've got to play catch up and get these vlogs happening. But I just wanted to say thank you to everybody who salvaged who salvaged my stuff and made it so that I can have a comfortable experience here at Tamworth. It's just an amazing atmosphere. Yeah, the numbers may be down, but the spirit's still there. It hasn't changed. Everybody's so fantastic. And if you're not here, you're missing out. You really are. Tamworth Country Music Festival. There's nothing like it. There's no festival like this one. And it's always looked after me. It's always been good to me. And I can't ask for more than that. Next day. It feels so good to have a bit of rain. But well, we might have to close you in. <laughs> we might have to close me in. 40, and I'm up for an award. Just had the dust on, and now we got some rain coming. The next day. So Over there. Alright, I'm not staying out here. We got a lightning storm over. Knocked the stage. Well, we can't have the stage at the moment, the lightnings are waiting for it to pass. Anyway, we'll see. How good is that? The Peel River is actually flowing. Oops, sorry, I just got the camera up against the railing here. Just getting a quick shot. So after all that heavy rain, it ain't much, but she's flowing, and that's what's good, and that's what matters.
Well, it's Saturday night. Well, it's Saturday night, and there is storm clouds all around us. Luckily, they are moving that way slowly. But yeah, Tamworth is surrounded by thunderstorms. We just don't want the lightning because the lightning shuts us down because we can't risk the equipment being fried. But we got awesome talent. We don't care about rain. We want rain in Tamworth. But yeah, we've just had the awesome Chloe Christine on. And look at the, we got people coming out ready for Mackenzie Lee. I'm on the footbridge from the campgrounds to the Bicentennial Toyota Park and this is why nobody is complaining about the rain in Tamworth. The Peel River is flowing again. Now I have to go back over the old footage which I'll probably show now if I do have some. But I can't remember if I got any footage of the Peel earlier on in the week. But there's actual water in the river today and it's flowing, which is a great sign. And this is why nobody complains about Tamworth getting rain, because they needed it. Well, the car bridge is just over there, down the river. You can just kind of see it maybe through the trees. And this is flowing straight to that and you saw how dry that was before. And that is why nobody is complaining about Tamworth getting rain. No one's complaining about the weather because it's just doing an awesome job. It's being nature and it's giving Tamworth some water. They need a lot more, but hopefully that'll be coming soon. And here we are going under the car bridge. You've seen me walk over many times. <laughs> Let's go have a quick look at the Peel River. You saw how it was just a little puddle well, it's flowing now. Might not be able to see it too well. But it's actually flowing. How good is that? That's what Tamworth needs. Bring it on. And there is the steps. Sun come out. There's the steps that you've seen me walk down and walk up and of course the campsite's there yeah so it's no secret that the numbers are down this year basically there was a perfect storm of circumstances that has led to a low number of people compared to previous years and it's gonna, people are going to see how important the festival is to this community and Tam has always been great to me so I always want to see it in a good light and see it succeed so come down to the Tamworth Country Music Festival in 2021 Bring a bit of spare change. No one's asking for charity. They're just asking you to enjoy yourself. So treat yourself and support these local people and the people that make this festival what it is. And help help the economy of this rural town. Well, it's a city now, but still. They definitely rely on the commerce of the festival. You know, and it's like, you know, I had somebody ask me the other day, I feel like I should be paying something for this stage. Cause like, as you know, I'm at Riverside, 
And I think this is the perfect example of what I'm saying. I had somebody say, I feel like I should be paying something. I, I just feel like I'm getting this for nothing. I said, you want to support the stage? Go to the canteen and buy some food. Buy some ice if you need it. Because Andy and Rhiannon are doing such a fantastic job on this stage. They don't ask for charity. Actually, they donate quite a lot of money when, you know, like last year I think they donated $2,000 to the buskers. You know, um, it was just such a great year. And they do that by having a successful run at the festival. So make sure you support them just by doing your thing. Nobody's asking you to donate money or anything like that. If you enjoy the music on the stage and you enjoy the artist, buy their CDs or buy a stubby holder. Um, and while you're here, buy a drink. You know, buy a can of drink or buy some food. Or if you gotta get some ice, get some ice. You know, that's what keeps this going. There's no secret to it. It's basic economics. So come have a good time and treat yourself. And at the same time, you're supporting people that are putting on entertainment and looking after you. You know, if you like what people do on the stage, buy some merch of this. Click like on their social medias. And of course, support the local businesses just by buying what you were gonna buy anyway. If you're, if you're thirsty, buy some drink. The one, the one, the shop that you buy from, that's the one you're supporting. <laughs> if you're hungry, buy some food, etc. You know the go. Anyway guys, I'm back. I got some job, I got a job to do. So I'll see you next time. Bye!